Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Kellen here with Droid Life. So I'm talking again today about Instagram. And now I know a couple of weeks ago we did a video on Instagram getting multi-account support. Well, that was short-lived. About an hour after I did that video, Instagram took away our multi-account support and it hasn't come back yet. So uh, anyways, though, the newest beta, which is 7.13.0, uh, is also seeing a new feature. And I don't know that this one's going to go away. You can see there's 7.13.0. So if you're in the beta, you can get this now and anyone can basically join the beta, I do believe still today. So uh, in this new beta though, you get a feature which is sort of like Apple's 3D touch where you can sort of long press on things and get a preview. So Instagram was one of the first apps to adopt Apple's 3D touch uh, where you can like pressure sense um, touches and then use different actions, right? This is sort of Apple's new feature and Instagram allows you to do that. And so looks like they're sort of enabling that, which is really just a long press feature on Android, but this is how it works. When you're in something like say the search page and you've got all the little thumbnail versions of images, you can now long press and just keep your finger. You can see I've still got my finger on the screen there and it pops up the image you want to look at. Um, you can do this uh, and just look at things and then keep scrolling and look at something else. Look at these Air Max 1s. And so you can just do that without having to dive into a photo and then back, back out. It's actually really, really handy for those of us who are constantly in the search page. So you can see long press, keep scrolling, long press. And you can do this in video as well. So if I long press on this NBA video, in a second here, you'll get to see Kevin Garnett just completely destroy Blake Griffin, which we always appreciate. So you can do video as well. Um, one of the things is if you scroll down with your finger still on the screen, you can actually like a post um, and then it'll go away. Or you can scroll down and look at straight into that profile or you can then directly share it. So uh, when you rub over these two, you'll feel a little vibration in the phone to know that you're doing that. But once you just let your finger go, it goes back to doing that. Now you can do this um, actually on your profile page as well. So anywhere you basically have these thumbnails, you can do this, uh, this sort of long press. Uh, it's really cool. And again, this is just on the beta, which should be coming to everyone fairly soon, I would imagine, 7.13.0. Uh, anyways, it's it's sort of like Apple's 3D Touch now on Android and probably one of the best features Instagram's uh, introduced in a while. So hopefully this one sticks and doesn't go away in an hour because I think you guys are all really going to enjoy this. So uh, comments, questions, let us know. Droid Life. Peace.